ABC's Rena Ruler reports now on the COVID-19 situation in the rest of the nation, including a request from one vaccine maker to expand its booster shots to all adults. More American adults could soon be eligible for an extra layer of protection against COVID. Pfizer now requesting FDA emergency use authorization for its booster shot for adults 18 and up. This as more vaccine mandates go into effect. In Los Angeles, people now required to show proof of full vaccination at many indoor businesses. We're all kind of getting burnt out on COVID, and this is the quickest and easiest way to make sure that we're moving forward. And now the Justice Department is asking the U.S. Court of Appeals to lift the temporary block on President Biden's mandate, requiring employees at all businesses with 100 or more workers to get vaccinated. The president and the administration wouldn't have put these requirements in place if they didn't think that they were appropriate and necessary, and the administration is certainly prepared to defend them. Meantime, emotional reunions continue coast to coast. The U.S. reopening its borders to vaccinated international travelers who show proof of a negative COVID test. Bhavna Patel seeing her grandson for the first time in a year and a half. There's no words. You can't describe. What, how do you describe this feeling? You know? Local businesses also hoping to see a boost. This reopening comes at an especially critical time because it allows local businesses to seize the economic opportunity presented by the holiday shopping season. The TSA says 40% of their workers are unvaccinated, but a source tells ABC the potential firings coming from the November 22nd deadline for federal workers to get the shot won't affect Thanksgiving flights. Rena Roy, ABC News, New York.